RJ. These here are two twins. Not two twins, but the twins. Correct? Alright, explain to us their issues. First, they came from a beef cow, right? Yep. Okay, and while beef cow can raise twins, this came from an old cow who had very little milk and colostrum. So, what's the difference between a beef cow and a dairy cow? Beef cow can't do it very well. That's right. A beef cow is made, she has more muscle and meat, whereas um, a dairy cow is big in milk production. So, um, we've got to get them fly sprayed. They have blood in their um, poop, right? Mm -hmm. Which means they more than likely have what? Coccidiosis. Coccidiosis. They were probably um, born with it. Oh, yes. And that's the little boy that RJ just doctored and has the ta terrible taste in his mouth. Um, we're going to clean him up. The little girl is standing back there. Um, so, we will get them going good, right? Alright. So, they're going to get um, Corrid for the coccidiosis. And then they're going to get Spectigard to help them not have diarrhea. Because the irritable bowel is probably what's causing the blood. But you don't really know, do we, son? And then we're going to follow it up with a lovely bottle of what? Colostrum. Okay, and colostrum is the first milk that um, a cow produces. It lines their tummy, gets them producing, or uh, gets them digesting food real good. So, and then the last thing we're going to do is fly spray these guys. I've got to get some hay in here. We had this stall for um, poor boy, Gordy, who is out there, huh? Hey, Gordy! And he's doing wonderful. He's got a crooked leg, but he's doing great. Um, so, and they're still out there cleaning up their feet. They're like, woohoo, they're still feeding here. So, anyway, we'll get some hay for bedding because they probably won't eat a whole lot of the hay. Um, and they probably won't eat uh, or drink a lot of water yet. But we'll put them on bottles and we'll um, leave the water as an offering so that, that way if they choose to. But... Oh, and he's tired. All right. RJ, will you stick your hand in their mouth and see if it's warm or cold? Warm. Warm? Okay. So, we do that for the simple fact that if it is cold, it means they need warming up. Um, and that way their body's not shutting down. Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. All right. oh, oh, easy. Don't kick him. And see, they've definitely got fly stuff here. All right. Here, give her this, and let's see if she'll, okay, it's colostrum, so, and it's got a big nipple, so we're going to do half a bottle to her. Yeah, let me turn this off and get to it. Half a bottle to her, half a bottle to him, we'll come back when we're done. Okay, so, we've doctored them, correct, with Corrid and Spectigard, um, and we fly sprayed them, right? And we saw one poop, which was really a bloody mess, correct? And the other one's pooper saw it, and it looked decent. And it looked decent. So, probably the one standing up was the one that the cow favored, and this one is the one that they tried to help along. Mm -hmm. What, how do you think all this un unfolded, played out, whatever you want to say it? They probably tried to give them bottles or something. Because they're beef cattle and she probably just doesn't produce enough, correct? Yep. So, beef cattle don't produce enough milk to really sustain twins because twins is uncommon in them. Somebody probably tried to help them along. These two guys are really tired and just wore out. So, we also gave them colostrum. We got a half a bottle down, the one laying down. And we only got a pint down um, the one standing up. But we'll bring it back out tonight and make sure that she gets it. And then they'll be on water. They're a little dehydrated. RJ, show people how to do the pinch test to tell. It's phone. <laughs> show them how to do the pinch test on the little boy. Okay. And it's much like the same in humans. If you pull up on them and it doesn't like snap right back down. I don't know if you can see okay, it there. that's loose. It's, yeah, but it, it goes it back down, but down. it's... But not real fast, right. right? And we want it to snap back. So they're a little dehydrated. See if she's dehydrated. See if she does. 
She still has some flies. We had to spray her to get the flies off. See, it's pasty. It, it's They're just dehydrated. So, I will bring out vitamins in a water bottle, correct? Okay, it's yeah. If it goes down, oops, I missed it on the camera. Do it again. I'm not a very good cameraman. It kind of hurts to do this test. Yes. You pinch, and as long as it goes straight down. Um, here, do me. Don't be mean. See? You're slow. You're I'm old. a little dehydrated. No, I drank a pop today, and pop dehydrates. So, I'm slow. You're but, old, too. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. That doesn't have anything to do with it. Bite your tongue, boy. Okay, so we'll get them on water bottles. If they're not rehydrated by tonight, what will we be doing? IV under the sun, under the skin, probably. Yeah. We don't want to, but no. if if he doesn't perk up with his drink and stuff, we will. I just a it's just a bubble under their skin with saline solution, and we will we'll get them going. They're gonna be great.